Hello everyone. You know, I have been doing this for a very, very long time. This is my 10th year on this platform making videos of content that I truly have a passion for. One of the few things that I have tried not to do throughout these last 10 years is get extremely angry about something that I shouldn't even be angry about. So, how about we catch up on a little bit of current events? Clearly, there are two big things that the Twitterverse is going crazy about. And let me just say, that's completely fine. Clearly, everything that has been going on with the protests for Black Lives Matter because of the death of George Floyd and Breonna Taylor, Ahmed Aubrey, and all of these other people whose lives were taken too soon, it's a terrible thing that it was done by law enforcement. Yes, absolutely. It's a terrible thing to see that there is still feelings of hate and racism specifically towards the black community in the year 2020. And the other thing is because of J.K. Rowling and what she has said about the trans community. So, look, I don't know how many of you are following me, and I don't know how many of you have been following me for a year, or three years, or all ten years. And if you've been here since the very beginning, God bless you, consider yourself one of the fortunate ones. But one of the few things you need to understand about me when it comes to social and political discussion, I don't want to live in an echo chamber. There are a great many things that I agree and disagree with, and there are many people who I have these discussions with, and let me just tell you, when I go towards someone with a debate on a topic that we both have completely differing opinions on, I walk away feeling like a much more intelligent and better person because I learned something about something I didn't even realize I knew nothing about. Let me just explain where I'm going with this. So. I'm sure that you've all seen the controversial video from Hannah Tay. Okay, this is someone that I've known about for many, many years, and there have been many times where I have watched and commented on her videos. And recently she made a video where she gave her thoughts about J.K. Rowling and J.K. Rowling's thoughts towards the trans community and what she said and what she agreed with and disagreed with. I watched that video. Did I agree? With everything she said in that video, the answer is no. There was one little thing that she said at the very beginning that I agreed with and I commented on. Do you want to know what that was? All I said was I agree with the separation of the art from the artist. The fact that there are people now looking at what J.K. Rowling has said and are now basically trying to say that Harry Potter is dead to them and they will never read those books again or buy any more of the merchandise. That's what's happening, and listen, I get it. I understand, okay? What she said, meaning J.K. Rowling, she didn't have any right to say it, but this is the problem and the best thing about living in a free society. We have the ability to speak our minds. Now, whether we're right about something or wrong about something, that's a different story. But a true, decent human being in this world should have the ability to say, I don't agree with what you said, but I will fight for your right to say it. That's what freedom of speech is all about. And all I said to this woman who posted this YouTube video was, I don't want to stop loving Harry Potter. But as far as I'm concerned, J.K. Rowling could end up in a ditch tomorrow and I won't even care. So, the fact that someone decided to take a snapshot of a couple of people who supported Hannah Tay's video, and mine just happened to be there, I'm just going to post that comment for you right now. So you've seen the comment, and now the ball is in your court. 
what did I say to offend the trans community? Just put your comments in the box below and tell me what I did wrong. So, the other reason why I'm making this video is to tell you all one thing. I am not afraid of this mob, okay? I am not afraid to speak my mind. I'm not afraid to debate with people who have different opinions than me. I am not afraid to go down without a fight. Because, quite frankly, I am going to be changing my whole format in 2021. And based on what is happening over the last couple of months, part of me is kind of damn happy that I'm doing it. I don't really know what else to say, but all I do know is that I have nothing against the trans community. I have nothing against people taking control of their own lives and living how they want to live and loving who they want to love and, more importantly, being who they want to be. That is individualism at its finest. It's what I support, 110%. So if you want to cancel me, all because of the fact that I agreed with one little thing on Hannah Tay's video, I'm not going to stop you. Because for me, it's always been quality over quantity. So I've got a couple of shelf tour videos coming up, and I know so many people were looking forward to those. So just be aware that moving forward, there's going to be a lot of Harry Potter merchandise on those videos, just expressing my love for this franchise. And if you seriously feel that there is something wrong with me because I just love these characters and love this story and don't give anything about the person who wrote it, then you have the right to feel that way and I am not going to fight you. You want to unfollow me? Fine. You want to unsubscribe to me? Fine. You truly never cared about me in the first place as a content creator or as someone that was just trying to be positive in this community. But I'm just going to leave you with one more thing. I stand with him. I do not care about her. That's it. Let that sink in. I'll see you in the next one.